Hi everyone, welcome to this tutorial. This is Nazmul Islam from Class Tips. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to change the default currency on PrestaShop. So let's get started. After installing the PrestaShop, you can see the home page like this. And uh, here you can see the currency in USD. So now we are going to change the currency default USD from the another currency. So to change the currency, we have to log into the back office. Here you can see we have just logged into the PrestaShop back office. And now we will go to the improve section and then go to the international and then click the localization. As you can see the new window open in the configure section here you can see default currency is us dollar so when you click the drop down here is only us dollar so we have to add another currency here so to add the another currency just go to the scroll up and you can see import a localization pack so we are now going to import a localization pack here so as we are going to install the euro so this is why we would like to import the germany content here so just set the germany local and now you can see the content to import so we are only going to import the currencies not other things so just check out of others and here only the currencies is set so download pack data is yes and just click the import and you can see the masses localization pack imported successfully so scroll down here default currency is us dollar just click over it and you can see the euro is here so here you can see a text masses so they strongly recommend to enable the maintenance mode when we are going to change the currency if you don't know how to enable and manage the maintenance mode in PrestaShop, then you can watch this video we will put this video link to the description box so here we will just click over the ok and now just click the save and just click over the view my shop and here you can see the currency is usd and here is the euro currency is added so two currencies here so you can use the multiple currency or you can use the euro currency however if you want to remove this usd from here then you have to go to the localization and then you can see the tab language currencies just click over the currencies so here you can see there is two currencies so this is the currency ids this is the currency euro and us dollar this is the symbol of the currency and this is the iso code which is international organization for standardization and here you can see the exchange rate and here you can see the enable and these are the same action so if you want to delete the us dollar then just click over it and here you can see the delete or if you don't want to delete it or you can just disable this so that your front office will not show this dollar then just click over this switcher and it will be disabled here you can see the status has been successfully updated so it is disabled now and just click the view my shop here you can see the euro is here and there is no usd because we have just disabled it and then you can see here you can delete or you can edit so if you want to edit this existing currency just click over the edit icon and now here you can see the currency name so if you want you can change the currency name uh, but you cannot change the iso code here and you can change the exchange rate here so exchange rate calculate from one unit of your shop's default currency so here you can see the decimal is two so this decimal is two that is means after decimal the two number will show or two digit will show so here you can see decimal after two digit but if you want to make it the three or four digit then it will show the four digit after the decimal here it is successfully updated the four digit will show now in the front office after the decimal so click the view my shop and here you can see the four digit is shown after the decimal so we can edit from the edit button 
so let's here set the two after the decimal so two digit will show and here you can see the status is uh, enable so you can disable it but for the default currencies we have only one currencies added you, if you have the multiple currencies then you can change the disable or you can the enable but if you have the only one currency set and which is the activated in the default so that case you cannot make it disable and now just click over the save so here is the successfully update so let's check the view my shop so here is the front office you can see in decimal we have set the two digit so after decimal two digit is show here so this is all about our tutorial if you have any question please leave the comment if you like this video then please don't forget to hit the like button and if you don't subscribe the channel then please do subscribe the channel and keep watching videos to learn more about pizza shop bye bye